What's up guys, Ryan Wright over here. So today I'm gonna check out a video from Honest Trailers called Hulk Honest Trailers. Remember that movie? The one that no one liked? <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's the Ang Lee version, the one with uh, Eric Bena. I haven't seen this movie in years, but I'm sure I'll get a lot of the insults. Love Mark Ruffalo. You tolerated Edward Norton, but admit it, you forgot about Eric Bana until I said his name just now. Get ready for the most forgettable movie about a giant rage-filled monster ever made in Hulk. <laughs> before Hulk was an Avenger, before he was even incredible, travel back to a time when Kevin Feige could still f up a superhero movie as director Ang Lee presents a two-hour long brooding think piece about a green guy who smashes things. <laughs> Stop staring at that bush and hit something! Meet Bruce Banner. You wouldn't like him when he's angry or calm or <laughs> happy. <laughs> Heartbeat. <laughs> 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 She's so hot. He's a monotone, unlikable scientist. We're doing the basic science for everyone. Working with his ex-girlfriend, Betty, a monotone, unlikable scientist. You're head of the base. I thought you were in charge. In one of the dullest superhero movies ever made that covers up its total lack of action with super wacky scene transitions. <laughs> Wow, it's just like reading a comic book. A terrible <laughs> Witness Banner's true nature unleashed when a freak accident turns him into a man who looks like he's struggling to hold in a fart. <laughs> Until he finally lets it go and becomes the hero that 2003 CGI clearly wasn't ready for. Resulting in a Hulk that's one part PlayStation cutscene, one part frat guy, and two parts Shrek. Hulk is love. Hulk is life. <laughs> All anyone wants to see is the Hulk go up against someone of equal or greater strength. Well, too bad, because this time the Green Giant is going toe to toe with lightweight non threats like this douche, the US military's full might of a few tanks and helicopters, Hulk dogs. Hulk dogs? You saved my life. Yeah, from a mutant French poodle. And Bruce Banner's own father, who's either an unpredictable mad scientist, or just Nick Nolte wandering onto the set and being himself for a few hours. <laughs> Resulting in an impossible to see climax that takes place at night, underwater, against a cloud dad thing. Thor the Dark World is looking pretty good right now, huh? Starring. Eric Banana, <laughs> Betsy Ross, Sam Elliott's mustache, Moss, Nick Nolte's mugshot, and don't make him angry, Salk. Hulk introspect. Be sure to subscribe for more honest trailers. Chewy, we are on home. Suffering succotash. I'm a simple man. I see beers. I press like. Michael Bay is a menace. The hammer of justice is unisex. I'm a lick, lick, a lick, a lollipop. <laughs> Wait. <a> <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that movie wasn't the greatest. <laughs> I went on opening night, so jacked to watch it, and I, I fell asleep. But the second time I watched it, you know, there are things about the film that I actually sort of appreciate. I personally don't find Eric Bana as boring as a lot of people did. I kind of did like how Ang Lee sort of edited it and shot it, kind of trying to make it look like a comic book. It was sometimes a little too in your, actually a lot of times a little too in your face, but for the most part, um, I, I appreciate a lot of its intent. I don't love the movie. I still fall asleep almost every time I check it out, 
but there are things about it that I do enjoy. There are things about it that are not so bad, but I can see why no one likes it. <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks for telling me that was out. If you're new to the channel, you can subscribe to The Real Rejects. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Uh, like I keep saying, Tyro Magnus, one million subscribers. Ryan Wright, product placement. Get a certain amount of followers on Instagram and Twitter, you can do product placement. Meaning I don't have to work as much to make a lot of money.